Okay, we're in the front end of the 24FB toy hauler. And in the front bedroom up here in the area, you have the medicine cabinet, the lavvy storage below. There's a shirt ward here. Overhead storage above the bed. Nice LED lights. And this is a queen bed arrangement with a window above the, the uh, head of the bed. There are a couple drawers underneath the bed. And in the bathroom here, you have the uh, Dometic foot pedal flush stool, the uh, tub shower combination. Then moving on back, you have nice storage here beside the entry door, a 30 inch wide uh, entry door. Gas electric double door refrigerator with cabinet doors above. The galley, there's your stereo, DVD player, there's TV hookups underneath, the TV mounts on the wall behind the sink, as a stainless steel sink, a three burner range with oven, stainless steel front oven, and stainless steel microwave. Coming more farther back in the, into the cargo area, you have storage on both sides. The overheads are secured to the ceiling as well as to the wall. And these cabinets have shelves on the inside and they're sized that you can fit a helmet underneath and gear up on top. And that same storage is mirrored on the other side here. You have large windows in the cargo area with pleated shades instead of mini blinds. The air conditioner is ducted through the ceiling and it's a double run ducting so you get twice the airflow. On the floor you have rubber back linoleum flooring, very durable. And you have these two sofas here that fold up to make more storage in a bed. So I'm going to show you how these work. What to do right now, these sofas are in a sitting position. These backs flip on over, and you see you have these legs. Go ahead and flip these legs down to make support for the bed. And you see them on the other side. When you bring these down in unison so the legs don't hit each other. And they come together right there to make nice full bed. Now I'm going to show you to put them up, bring them both up together, and you fold this up against the wall here, and secure it with a strap. Do that on the other side here as well. Hold it on up against the wall. Strap it. Hold the legs up. And this gives you six feet of storage between these wheel wells. These wheel wells are made out of steel, not wood covered with carpet or wood covered with diamond plate and steel. So if you have two quads and you put them side by side, it's wider than six feet, you can put a board between these wheel wells and then strap your equipment down. In addition to that, you're 10 feet 6 inches in length right to here, and you're 13 feet 6 inches up here to the middle. The other thing you have is the optional electric bed. And this bed works off of a 12 volt motor. And this is a queen size bed. So when this will come down, it gives you additional sleeping. Go ahead and run it all the way down so you see how low it goes. This bed is ready for a second bed. The rack is already here. So you put two beds 
set of one, it is available. Now for the back wall, there are a couple of options you have for a screen. One is you can have a pull-down screen. Another one is there's a carefree add a wall, which is like a tent wall with a zipper in the middle. The benefit of that one is it's vinyl over screen. So if it's a windy day or the sun's coming in the back, you can roll up a quarter of it to have ventilation and light, but not have to have the whole thing up. And if you're sleeping back there and want more privacy at night, you have the benefit of that canvas. So check with your dealer about adding a screen wall on the back or the add a wall. Thank you for watching this video on the 24-hour